I picked up some new Omni antennas for the 3DR Solo. I had no idea if it would work or not, but I thought I'd give it a try. First thing I had to do is figure out the connectors. As you can see in the chart here, the antennas are reverse polarity SMA male, which makes the transmitter reverse polarity SMA female. On Amazon, I was able to find the 6 and 9 DBI high fine Omni antennas. On the left, you'll see the stock 3DR solo antennas. In the middle, the 6 dBi. And on the right, 9 dBi high fine Omni antennas. As you increase the gain of an Omni antenna, vertical beam width changes. As found in the high fine data sheet, 6 dBi gives you a 40 degree vertical beam width, and 9 dBi gives you a 25 degree vertical beam width. Today in the field, I experienced a significant change between the 6 and 9 dBi Omni antennas. Using the 9 dBi Omni antennas, it took everything I could to get a link all the way out to 5,000 feet. I manipulated them every which way and found it very difficult to maintain comms. Not to mention that the 9 dBi antennas are too heavy for the transmitter and shift position at random. Using the 6 dBi on the antennas, I was able to get out to 6,000 feet. I was very pleased with that performance, and for the flying I do, I'll stick with the 6 dBi on the antennas, or even the stock 3DR solo antennas. By the time I got out to 6,000 feet, the battery was down to 50%. When it finally landed, I was right around 22%. So increasing the speed to get further distances is definitely necessary. This is the 9 dBi antenna flight. As you can see, I had to stop the drone often to manipulate the antennas to keep comms.